Inspecting slaughterhouses is a very unique job. There are currently only 8 people doing this in the whole of Singapore. But I'm quite a clean freak, so when I told my parents I wanted to do this, they were so surprised. Hi everyone, I'm Jolene and I've been with Singapore Food Agency Slaughterhouses Inspection Team since 2019. So we are responsible for enforcing the hygiene and food safety practices of all pigs and poultry slaughterhouses in Singapore, and even frog, crocodile and turtle processing plant. About one third of our chicken meat and one fifth of our pork are processed in local slaughterhouses. The meat goes directly to wet markets and supermarkets, or even directly to FMB establishments. We are the first line of defense to ensure that freshly slaughtered meat is safe for consumption. Usually, we start our day with visits to one or two slaughterhouses. Um, we'll inspect the cleanliness of the facility, the health of the animals that comes in, and we also inspect the carcass and organs for possible contamination. We also take carcass and swap samples, which we will bring back to SFA labs for testing. So I have a background in food science, but this job wasn't something I ever imagined doing. So I was just looking for work after graduation, and I came across an ad to join the Slaughterhouses team. So I thought it sounded really interesting, and it was just kind of a YOLO moment for me. So the smell and the mess was something that um, I had to get used to at first. So there was once where I was taking a swap sample from a chicken, and then it splattered droppings all over my face. So I was just stunned and trying to process what happened. But I think the toughest part for me is our work schedule, because sometimes we have to work during odd hours, where we inspect all the slaughterhouses from the middle of the night until early morning. And we sometimes also have to work on Sundays, so planning weekends can be quite hard. Despite the irregular working hours, I still really like this job because we get to go overseas to credit farms and establishments before the exports to Singapore. And we're also a key part in planning the contingency responses to diseases like bird flu, which spreads via livestock. But I think my favourite part is learning about the bad signs because we get to learn how to spot symptoms of illnesses in livestock, such as if chickens have droopy heads or if pigs have skin lesions. For pigs, we even inspect their limb nodes after slaughtering. So this work is definitely more interesting than I expected. So I've definitely learned to appreciate this industry a lot more. It's been an eye-opening experience to see so much effort put in to ensure food safety and to mitigate infectious disease risks. I think it's rare to find experiences that are both unique and meaningful. In my own way, I'm happy to keep meat safe for Singaporeans' consumption. I think it's a one-of-a-kind opportunity that I really cherish.